ケンちゃんがそれを取れるかどうか、多分違うと思うから。What's up guys, this is BK. So today's video, we are he out here at Formula Drift Long Beach, streets of Long Beach. It's gonna be a great time. The weather's great, about 60s or so. I'm still kicking in here in the shade because I'm probably gonna be burnt out. I'm probably gonna, I'm probably gonna break this into two videos. First video, we're gonna be out here checking out all the race booth, all the race cars, all the drift cars, just seeing what we find. And then there is a, there is a section for all the show cars. So I believe Gil and HHW collectibles are out there, so we're gonna go check them out afterwards. So we came to pick at Kangushi's booth, some of his merch here. Top 32, well, Top 32 didn't finish, but he just ran Top 32 and uh, he got the win, so he's going to Top 16 now. He should be coming anytime soon. So we're out here kicking in at Kangushi's booth. He's back now. So I was talking to Tice Motorsports. They did some of the fabrication on this. Crazy setup, how they do everything from a, you know, drawing sketch on the paper, just itch and scratch, to a 3D render and then a full produced CNC part. So pretty much I had to do a lot of custom parts to get this engine to fit in here. Obviously mortar mounts, uh, intake manifold, a bunch of stuff engine it's pushing about 920 horsepower set up all night trip you know i'm not going to make it seem like i know everything about this engine but it is pretty interesting everything that goes behind this and how many people it takes so all these projects it's not just a one day or a one video thing it takes months even a year or two to get all this developed and made so hella cool setup thank you king gushi for letting me hang out here at your booth now officially authorized seller for many parts so if you guys haven't checked out the website make sure to check it out i'm uploading it every day every day there's new content new stuff on there i am now officially authorized seller for many parts so if you guys haven't checked out the website make sure to check it out i'm uploading it every day every day there's new content new stuff on there my focus is first the fk8 i still got a lot of parts i need to add on for the fk8 but Inputting parts onto a website, it's, I'll be honest, it's not fun. <laughs> I think I've spent over a hundred hours and I'm not even done with the FKA catalogs. Next, after that, I wanna work on updating the website with all the FL5 parts, all the Type S parts, Integra parts, 11th gen Civic SI, non-SI, 10th gen SI, non-SI 10th gen. I don't know how many of you guys are old enough for this, but 2008 Tanner Fowles pretty much came into the competition, just started winning and winning back to back. It was pretty cool to see him. Uh, I don't know what he's up to now, but I do know for after Formula Drift, he did go into rally racing. So it's pretty cool historic stuff here at the wall.
Leave a comment if you guys do some sim racing yourselves. Rockstar Supra. Last year's champion. They look clean. That's not perfectly placed there for marketing. <laughs> This side we got the NAS booth, so the new 400Z. Leave a comment, it's been a few months. How do you guys feel about the new Z? Now, personally, I wasn't a big fan of the blue interior, but now that I see it in person, I know the camera, you can't really tell, but you got blue seats, blue door panels. The door panels are pretty nice. It's different though. It's different, I like it. But I would still prefer the a white Z with probably red interior. Maybe this isn't the best time to come walk around. All the cars are pretty much practicing, getting ready for top 32. So probably come back later, get you guys some better content. But meantime, I'll probably walk around myself still just to see what's going on. You never know what you might find. So at least here in California, I don't know about the other states, but in California, you don't really see S15. It's pretty sick to see one here. And gonna be 25 years soon. A lot of people are gonna start shipping them here to Cali also. It looks so good. Damn. Talk about the dashboard. Super clean. It's hella cool. And if you guys don't know, check out the website. We now are an authorized seller to sell a bunch of products. wings out here looking hella clean sadly it looks like he's not practicing as you can tell the car does have a pop tire so something must have happened where he's pretty much out of the race I'll make sure to give you guys an update if I can find out but uh yeah it's, it's always good it's always great to see Forrest Wing out here I've known or not I don't want to say I've been following him because uh you know, I'm not the craziest nerd about Forrest Wayne, but it's a pretty sick setup. I've always liked his setup with his S15. Always doing different stuff, hella extreme, hella wild with all the colors and graphics, everything. Looks so good. <laughs> you're a little guy, but you're too big. <laughs> this is my dog. That's hella cool, man. Letting, him, let the, letting the kid get in the car. It's all you, Take it out. That's go. super cool, letting the kid yeah. in the car. Every kid's dream of being a freaking race car. I remember seeing this car at SEMA, it's hella sick though. Yeah. Crazy setup Corvette. If I got a C5, I probably would do this setup. Just because it's completely different. It looks so good. Got a full on shark nose going on.
So we got some of the peeps here, Fern 400. These guys, they sell posters. Hella crazy setup, what they got. I think at one point they had Gills type bar up here. We got tree fog. Stuff smells hella good. The best part today, you literally just got four bangers, V6, V8, big turbos out there at the track. Get to hear them all day. APR performance and NSX. Looks hella good. Looks hella good. And we got Jeff's Type R out here. Collaborating with Auto Tune, APR, PRL, Mall 2, of course, starting grid. So, if you guys don't know it, you guys don't know, if you're from SoCal, you probably know, but Auto Tune, their shop out here, it's SoCal, but they also have a section called Starting Grid where they host their own track event. Crazy E30 setup right here. Crazy how functional it is. It's like full on race car, full on road cage. They still got the performance to back it up. I don't think the video is doing justice, but this paint is hella flawless. You guys can't forget shout out to all shout out to all my homies from garden grove so you guys don't know i grew up in garden grove so seeing vip builds is always a nostalgic feeling for me larry chen supra is out here earlier larry chen was in this car he was doing some filming hella sick setup hella sick setup literally it's just a car for him to be following on the car. So talk about functional yet still looking good. Brand new generation out here. Leave a comment, how do you guys feel about it? I don't know, it's more and more like a Camaro because of the color. But it does look like to me a Camaro. Gives me Camaro vibes for sure. All right, guys, so we're back at the pad. First of all, I'd like to say at this point, you've already seen the results. Uh, I'm barely gonna watch the top 16. 
uh, for the fact is I came home as quick as possible because I rather watch top 16 via YouTube. If you guys didn't know, you can watch all of these races on YouTube on Formula Drift. They have their own YouTube channel and they post live coverage. But the reason why I came home to watch it at home was for the fact that I didn't have a dedicated seat. So just like a concert, you got to go through Ticketmaster, get a dedicated seat. And then from that seat, you know, it's just like a concert. You get your seat and then you get to watch it. If you don't get your ticket within the first week or two, there's a very low chance you're going to get a seat for the fact that there's only X amount of seats and there's tens, 20,000 people that come to Formula Drift. That's the reason why I came home, just so I can watch the races comfortably from my couch with Kaizen. I think he prefers me on the back end, um, but shout out to you, man. Really appreciate it, you making moves. So because of him, got to go to Formula Drift. Because of him, I got to hang out at Ken Gucci's booth. Because of him, I've had the opportunity to be in a lot of places and meet a lot of places because of him. So I really wanna say shout out to you, man. Really appreciate it. It means a lot to me. When people make moves for me, it's like, you know, it's just, it's amazing. Cause I, at the end of the day, I'm a nobody. I'm just a guy with a camera. So because of him, I just want to say thank you. My intention with the website is obviously you can always buy my merchandise. You can get my merchandise. I originally started as a photographer. So if you guys are ever want a picture on your wall or something, make sure to check out my canvas. Last thing I'd like to mention is again, really appreciate it. I'm now an authorized seller for many parts. I've been able to get a contract or an account to be able to sell these parts. So we got rays, gram lights, inky wheels, Gretty parts, HKS parts, food, uh, Revel parts, APR, uh, Voltec, not Jay's Racing, not PRL, but we can get Boris, we can get Recaro, Bright Seats, Brom Seats, shoot. I think even if you wanted XXRs, I probably could get them. <laughs> like you never know who you may meet. Like because of me going to SEMA, meeting certain people, I was able to make relationships and be able to make an account. So in the day guys, as I get older, doesn't matter what industry you are in, this is probably hella long at this point, but doesn't matter what industry you're in. In the day, it's all about who you know, networking, and just being yourself, right? Um, like I said, I'm just a dude with a camera that I end up documenting, but uh, yeah, guys, so <sighs> just like to say thank you guys for everyone. Really appreciate if you guys give a thumbs up. If you made it this far, really appreciate it. If you leave a comment, just leave like Kaizen 2023 or something. Vote Kaizen 2023, I don't know, something like that. But yeah, guys, so if you guys made it this far, I really appreciate if you leave a comment. All right, guys, catch you guys next time. Peace, boys.